Good morning, my students. Today, we are starting a grammar lesson titled The Simple Sentence. Let's take a look at some examples and their parts and see why they are simple. Collins Unit 5, Student Book, page 61. These are the major parts of, uh, of the sentence, subject, verb, object. Subject, the person or thing that does something. For example, she likes cats. She, subject. Verb, a word that expresses an action or a, state of, or a state of being. She likes cats. Likes, verb, object. A person or thing that received the action of a verb. She likes cats. Cats. Object. Subject, verb, and object. This is also their order. Subject, verb, object. In English word, order is very important. Sarah is eating an apple. Sarah. Subject. Is eating. Action, the verb, an apple, object. English sentence basic five structures. Subject verb, for example, the boy plays. The boy, subject, plays, verb. Subject, verb, object, for example, John kicks the ball. John Subject, kicks, verb, the ball, object. Object, verb, adjective. For example, the girl is pretty. The girl, subject, is, verb, pretty, adjective. Subject, verb, adverb. For example, the, the boy ran quickly. The boy, subject, ran, verb, quickly, adverb. Finally, subject, verb, noun, for example, the boy is a student. The boy, subject, is, verb, student, noun. Subject, verb, object. I like eggs. I, subject, like, verb, eggs, Object. She sees her sister. She, subject, sees, verb, her sister, object. He is reading a book. He, subject, is reading, verb, a book, object. In English sentences, always have this order. Subject, verb, object. I, she, he, are the subject. Like, sees, is reading, are the verbs, eggs, her sister, a book, are the object. Don't forget this note, it's very important. In English sentences, always have this order. In English, word order is very important. This is also the order. Subject, verb, object, for example, he reads books, he, subject, reads, of a verb, books, object. Can you form your own sentences now? Review. Word order. Subject, verb, object. The final note. In English, sentences always have this order. Now, my dear students, open your booklet, page 25. Booklet, page 25. A simple sentence has a subject and a verb. One subject, one verb. To make simple sentence. For example, the boy ran. The boy, subject, ran, verb. 
She is cooking. Another example. She, subject, is cooking verb. Sentences need an object. Sometimes, not always. For example, we drank juice. We, subject, drank, verb, juice, object. Now, according to the exercise, can you decide what parts we have? Subject, verb, or object. We have 10 sentences. Number one, let's start. Okay. Mr. Buck gave Tom his notebook. Gave. Subject, verb, object. Yes, thank you. It's a verb. Next, number two. After the final song, the drummer rolled his sticks at the crowd. Drummer. Excellent. Subject. Three. Yes. Smash his electric guitar with a hammer. Guitar. It is what? Object. Yes. Thank you. Next. Sarah drew a dragon. Dragon. Sarah. Subject. Draw. Verb. Dragon. According to the word order. Excellent. Object. Five. Very slowly, Mary opened the books. Mary. It is what? Great. Thank you. Subject. Six. Very slowly, Mary opened the books. Opened right now. It is what? If Mary is the subject, so open will be the verb. Thank you. Eight. Seven. Very slowly, Mary opened the books. Books here. Great. Object. Thomas gave his pen to Bingo. Gave. Yes, from give. Oh, yeah, I know that. It is what? It's a verb. Excellent. Thank you. After breakfast, Peter drove to the mall with Ted. Peter. Yeah, I know drove. It's a verb. Peter is what? Yeah, it's a subject. Great. And the last one, Professor Larry carries his umbrella wherever he goes. Carries. Present simple. Yeah, I know that. It is what? Yes, it's a verb. Yes, great. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. All these are simple sentences. All these are simple sentences. Now, next exercise, which is the last one, I want you to underline the subject, circle the verb and the object in the following sentences. Number one, just we have four sentences. The customers leave the shop. Now, the customer is what? Come on, boys. Yes, it's a subject. Let's underline. What is the verb? Come on, think about that. Left? Yeah, it's left. Let's make a circle. And uh, the last one, the show. Yeah, great. Underline the show. Thank you. Let's underline. Next one. The girls are my sister. What is the subject? Good. Good. The girls, the subject. So, what is the verb? Come on, boys, think about that. What is the verb? Excellent. Oh, yes. And the object? Great, my sister. Yes, that's it. Go on. Let's move on to the next one. A dog chased us. What is the subject? Good. A dog. So, where is the verb? Yeah, chase. Excellent. And the last one, us, which is the, yes, object. Great, thank you, excellent, I like that. And the last one, sharks eat fish. Sharks, yeah, you know sharks, yeah. The subject, sharks, subject. Where is the verb? Great, eat, eat, which is the verb. And finally, fish, which is the object. Excellent. Thank you. That's a great. Thank you, my students. And see you next time.